So today we're going to make the pen section that holds the nib and the ink pump on the other side. Um, this is one I've made already and I'll walk you through the process of producing this. You've got three distinct uh, sections to, to produce, three uh, operations. Number one, forming this tenon with the M10 thread. Secondly, forming this diameter here and profiling to, to meet your, your personal needs. And then finally, the, the drilling and tapping of the inside um, that takes the actual nib itself. So let's just get started. Um, firstly, I've, I've loaded a piece of ebonite, red streak ebonite with black into the, the collet shop. Looks quite nice. Um, I'll go through, number one, I'll form the tenon for the M10 thread. Secondly, I'll turn the ebonite down to 13 millimetres. That's the right diameter to suit the M14 cap that you will see later on. And then finally, I'll turn it round and I'll form all the inside drilling and inside tapping. And it's, it's important that we do it in that order, in order that the thing doesn't snap when you're machining it. So do all your outside turning, then do your drilling and tapping and do it in that order. So let's go through the process. I won't talk much through this, I'll, I'll just let you watch the, the machining. So M10 thread with the tenon first. In terms of length of the tenon, not really important at this point in time. I tend to target for between eight and you know six to eight millimeters. So that diameter just now is 12, 12.4, so two and a half to go. about good. Ten point three, so that's good. Two one zero. Just do a final cut to get ten millimeters. quick check before we thread. So that's bang on 10. So let's um, get the, the taps and dies. So I tend to keep all my taps and dies in small drawers. So all the taps, the, the, dries, the dies for a given size plus the, the drill for the appropriate size of, of thread. Take out the tap. <coughs> And another very handy small tool is a tailstock die follower, which keeps your dies nice and straight. So let me just put it in. That's it nipped up 
and just the smallest piece bit of oil on the tenon. Just swap my Jacob's chuck over for the die follower. And it may be difficult to see with the, the camera there, but really all I'm doing is forming this M10 by 0.75 thread. And this is the, the tenon that will screw into the, the pen body. Just hand tight up to the shoulder and take it back. And there we go, that's all that's required there. Now, you could go on and reverse the die and run it up, which ensures that your threads are nice and parallel. And I'll just do that by hand. But I would recommend if you're doing it first, first few times, you put it back into the, the tailstock die follower just to make sure that your your dies are staying straight. So that's a perfect fit. I'm pleased with that. Next step is to turn this outside diameter down to the 13 millimeters. Now, in terms of length, the, the overall length of the um, the overall length of the the nib, the fountain pen nib, is twenty millimeters. So you want to be drilling just beyond twenty. Sorry, did I say drilling? I meant turning, just beyond 20. So I'll just get my my parting off tool and take it just beyond 20. And that'll tell me where to stop. Just a small mark. You can always trim the length to be more exact when you come to at the end of the process. And now we can start with the, the, the turning down to 13 millimetres. Check with the mic. Fifteen 
15.7 so we've got a bit, a bit to go Check. Always better to be too much material than not enough. That's 14.1. So we've got the, the diameter isn't really critical as long as it's less than 14, because that's the root diameter of the sorry that's the main diameter of the thread. So you want to come between 12 and a half and 13 millimeters. I think that's going to be quite close. 13.4, so let's just take off that point four. One, two, three, four. at the right outside diameter the thread's been cut 13 dead 13.06 millimeters so that's perfect now we'll just do a wee bit of shaping on the OD and we'll drill through for the diameter of the thread for the box 6 